Hey, what's up everybody? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use Wart, also known as King Arthur. Wart is not a limited time zoom, so you could actually get Wart after this month's event if you really want Wart. Unfortunately, Wart is not gonna be one of the top zooms. However, he does get a lot better at the top range, so like at skill level 6 or 5, he becomes usable. There are better zooms out there that clears a vertical line, so maybe he's not the one that you want to try to get. Uh, for the purpose of functionality or coin earning potential, Wart is not going to be one of the better ones. There is a lot more involvement to using Wart. You do have to swipe up during his animation, but we'll get into that a little bit more later. I'm also going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of Wart at skill level 1, 2, and 3 and show you the animation and also the clear ability and clear ranges. So, Stay tuned for that, but first let's take a look at the stats. In order for you to fully charge Wart, you'll need to clear a total of 14 zooms, so pretty low in terms of charging up the ability. His minimum score is 140 with a maximum score of 875. Pretty high minimum score, but a pretty low maximum score here. And if you want to get Wart to skill level 6, you're going to need to collect a total of 32 zooms, and that is pretty normal for a premium zoom that is not limited. Alright, so now let's take a look at the skill ranges. His skill ranges does expand in size, the clear radius as you level him up. And one of the best strategies to using Wart is that you want to make sure that in the center of the screen, there's abundance of zooms before you actually swipe up. And don't worry about swiping up fast or there's no timing to this. Essentially, as long as you swipe up in a given time, then you'll be able to clear a vertical line. Even if you don't swipe up, the game will automatically swipe up for you. If you wait like 5 seconds or so, it will automatically do it. So there's really no wrong way of doing it. So which brings me to my second point that the swipe up motion is an extra step, but it does get you a little more involved. So depending if you like the extra animation, then you may or may not like Ward. But let's also take a look at uh, his ability. Let's compare his ability side by side. So as I mentioned, you will need to pull the sword up. I was playing around with it to see if that mattered and it didn't actually. No matter how fast or slow you swiped, it's all the same. So as you can see that the ranges do vary from size to size. For skill level one, I got a size of 21 chain. Skill level two, I got a chain of 22. And skill level 3, I got a chain of 25. And your results may vary depending on how compact the center of your screen is. I also want to skip to the end of the game to show you the core and earning potential between these three skill levels. And as you could see, they're not going to be amazing for coins. And also keep in mind that I do have 5 4 on. So war is not going to be great for corn earning because of that. And in terms of score, it's not bad, but it's also not great. I wouldn't necessarily use Wart for a high scoring zoom, nor to earn coins. So definitely not one I recommend getting for the purpose of trying to get coins or get a high score. But if you like Wart or like the King Arthur series from Disney, then definitely this is one to have. So that's pretty much it for Wart. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. And if you would like to see more Zoom Zoom content, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching.